So just give this a shot. This is a, yeah. So I'll, I'll play the first line actually. Okay, one hand then the other. This tune is, the good thing is it's one hand then the other hand is back and forth, but you gotta pay attention, right? Uh, so just that first line, it's, the whole tune is built on this little lick, right? Being able to do this, right? The lick is this. So it's, it's just like your five finger position, right? All your fingers, each of your fingers is on one each key, right? So you're going two to three, right? So it's a quick boom, like that. But then there's that extra harmony and note up there. So it's your pinky and your second finger, followed by your third finger. On F. On wherever it's going to be. Okay, okay. This so is, it's going to move around. Okay. That's But the, the shape that your hand it's makes the is the same. So okay. sometimes you're going to do it with your pinky on C. Sometimes your pinky is going to be on G. Sometimes your pinky is going to be or on F. Sometimes, right? But it's the same. It, it looks the same. You're just moving around okay. this way. Okay. Right. Now, uh, so all the notes are there, but you start with one of those, and then you go back here to C and G. So just being able to do that. Those are the first two notes. And then you jump down, G and D. So it's sort of like opposite. You start with the lick, and you go down. And then you go here, down with the lick. But it's the same shape. That was the, just the first four chords, right? So he's playing around a little bit. So you lick first, and then two and five. And you jump down here so your pinky's on G. And then you do two and five, and then the lick. Okay? So that little tiny note, that's called a grace note. So every time you see a grace note, that's what you're doing. You're doing one of these licks. That's it. So again, the first one, you do the lick, then you do two and five. I'll put the fingering on there. And then you do two and five, and then the lick. And then you jump down here, pinky on G. It's an octave down from where you just were. And then you do the lick twice. That's these oh, two, I'm sorry. right? Okay. Yeah, okay. So up here on pinky on C, lick, then two and five, then pinky on G, two and five, then the lick. And then, and then you jump down an octave and do the lick twice with your pinky on G. And then, so that's that's the, once you get through that, that's the biggest hump to, to figure out in the beginning. Then your bass line. Okay? Your left hand doesn't move, it just stays, your thumb is on C, right? So you go four, three, two, one, that's it. Bum, 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 bum. And then we get into the meat. Sure, if we should, well, I'll, I'll explain it. I don't know. If, see if you can get through the first part. If you can get through the first part, then uh, you can do this. So C and then the lick, C lick, and then that five and two, and then you jump back to your G with the lick. Okay. Okay. So stuff you've done already in the intro, but it's just a little bit different. Okay, and then D and C, and you move over a little bit, buddy. It's all right, bud. It's okay, bud. Just relax. Cool. <laughs> then you do the lick with your pinky on F, and then F, and then the lick with your pinky on C. So every time you see that little grace note, that's just the lick, okay? So try not to be confused by that. So that first line again, or the second line, sorry, you go C and then pinky on C with the lick, two and five. Then your pinky's on G with the lick, and then two, one, which is D and C, and then you move over one, play the lick, then you jump down here, F, lick, okay? Will you put some finger Yeah, there? just take your time, Okay. practice the lick with your pinky on C, with your pinky on G, with your pinky on F, with your pinky on C, and G, okay? <laughs> it's the same thing, you're just moving around. I can't wait to get home and practice, but I'm still thinking about it.